Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing well and staying safe. Welcome back to my channel. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for tuning back in. And if you are new here, here, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and come back please for more luxury related content. So yes, um, I've got a small Dior reveal today. Uh, this is not a true unboxing because I bought this last year, um, probably towards um, the end of November. And yes, I've used it since then. Um, you know, I was traveling, I just couldn't film and i wanted to post it on instagram but before that i thought i of course show my youtube family so i will reveal to you guys what i got and this has been on my wish list for quite some time i wish i had pulled the trigger earlier because prices have just of course increased and increased since then and i was like if not now then never because i was not going to pay more than what i already paid for this so let me quickly show you guys without rambling too much uh, it is, of course, a small leather good, as you can see from the little uh, box. I am so sad that I did not get the Christmas packaging at the time I bought this because apparently it had not launched in Singapore then. So I picked up the Lady Dior Kanaj wallet, right? So now, you guys, this had been on my wish list for such a long time. I'm going to take out all the wrapping so I can show you guys the wallet in its true glory. And um, yeah, like I said, I had been wanting to get this for the longest, longest time. Um, I had just been eyeing it. I needed a compact wallet, which was a full size so I could slot in my bills. But I was just not ready to get another Louis Vuitton one. <laughs> I wanted to do something different. I, of course, had the Victorine wallet in mind because, again, that is compact, yet it is a full size. But then this is something that I had on my list. Um, you know, I really wanted to get something from Dior. I don't own anything from Dior except for a pair of shoes and this is definitely my second item. And I thought, why not? Um, you know, I'll pull the trigger now because after this, you know, for me, it's not justified to pay like, you know, a little like over like what seven eight hundred Singapore dollars for a small leather good um, which is what I did pay for this um, so yeah um, I will be reviewing this because now that I have used it for two months I know exactly what I need to say and I'll just give you a little overview of the wallet I will of course like always share more details on like the aesthetics in my reviews I don't do that in my unboxings because I like to give a whole thorough review of um, you know uh, whatever I have used uh, in the review video and a lot of you really appreciate that so thank you for that I got lots and lots of questions on my my YSL review uh, wallet reviews my Louis Vuitton handbag reviews so thank you for appreciating those I do try and put in a lot of effort into whatever I am reviewing with literally my 100% honest thoughts so like I said I know exactly what I'm gonna be saying about this um, I'm not going to disclose what I have in mind, so you'll have to wait for the video. But like I said, a really brief overview of what the wallet looks like. It's got a small pocket, um, zipper pocket here. Um, you know, you could use that for coins, you could use that for extra cards. So I housed like my extra cards here. I had my ID and my credit card slotted in here. And then like I said, bills. So I traveled with this for like more than four or five weeks um, and it was quite handy. You can see there are a few imprints inside because it is really soft lambskin. So yes, it was really, really prone to like scratches like that. And But that's all right. I don't mind. I feel those are the characteristics of the um, item itself. And I really like that once I've started using it. And of course, it's got the little Dior charm. So yeah, I was lucky this was in store when I went to pick it up. Um, apparently, it was the last new piece that they had uh, at that time. And yeah. So here it is, my little beauty. Um, it is, I don't have any compact wallets in my collection. Like I don't have anything which is compact yet full. I've only got my Chanel, um, you know, long wallet, the classic one, the continental one. And yeah, this is the second one I have, which is like a full one. So really, really like it and glad I picked this one up. So thank you guys for watching and please stay tuned for the next one. Bye guys.